the dynamics of Chelsea transfer is changing. The fans still not get it. Kepa Ariza Balaga to Munich is in progress and Munich have contacted Chelsea. Liverpool outbeats Chelsea. But hey, there are still sources saying Chelsea is not giving up yet. Hurricane to Bayern Munich, here we go. What's up guys? Welcome to Ashley Sports. If you are new, subscribe, turn on your notification bell, like and share the video and let's get you the details. <music> Finally, Bayern Munich have decided to contact Chelsea for Kepa Ariza Balaga. Now, Robert Sanchez will be smiling all over if Chelsea agreed deal with Bayern Munich because there was a competition between these two players and Bayern number one position is lying down vacant and they think Kepa is the right keeper for them. But hey, it's not over. I told you in my previous videos that it's a competition now between Bayern and Real Madrid as Cotua had injury in his anterior crochet ligament. So let me know your opinions as this deal progresses. But hey, Real Madrid haven't contacted Chelsea and personal terms have not yet contacted. Let's see how this is going to be. But Munich is in progress because Thomas Tuchel wants to work with Kepa once again. Here we go for England international Hurricane and Tottenham striker. What a decision he has made finally. In my preview, I told you he was going to make a decision because Bayern Munich have beat over 100 million euro for hurricane and tottenham have agreed and now it was left with hurricane to make that decision the decision has been made he's on his way to uh munich to do his medicals and medical and everything have been set up for a uh, hurricane let's see how hurricane will be able to perform in munich shed if you think he's going to win trophies with munich let me know your opinions in the comment section and things are really moving on in this transfer window chelsea fans yet again they still don't get it the dynamics of transfer for chelsea is changing no more spending huge sums of money for players after enzo fernandez chelsea is not ready to spend that much for any player or any transfer again the situation is just in front of us but we the fans just need more players and we need more money to be spent hey <laughs> we all know Todd Bowley and his entourage taking over Chelsea wanted to do something they have an idea they have a program plan for Chelsea and this is how they intend to do it after following Casado for over three months refused to give what Brighton is asking for Liverpool have come on to overbeat Chelsea and hey it was a battle and the battle was just Brighton needed a team who will overbeat each other between Chelsea and Liverpool. In the finals last night Chelsea were able to beat up to 100 million the action price for Brighton but hey Liverpool overbeat of 110 million and now papers are being signed for Liverpool. But other sources are still saying that Chelsea is not giving up yet. But is it that they are going to break bank again for Moises Casado because the player really wants to come to Chelsea and he has been saying it made it clear to Brighton that the only team he wants to go is Chelsea. But now Brighton intend to sign him for Liverpool because Liverpool overbeat Chelsea. Is there going to be changes in this? I don't think so. This transfer window, we all see what the board and Lawrence are doing. They are signing players under 50 million. And even as we said, Lavia Chelsea interest right now have beat less than 50 million and the action price is 50 million. Let's see how this is going to go because I don't think with this Caicedo deal is going to be something huge for Chelsea because there is a divided decision or there's a divided interest from the fans. Some are saying yes Brighton is now a business club to earn money from uh, other clubs 
because they had Caicedo for just 4.4 million uh, euros and now they are selling him over 100 million pounds for sure and others think Caicedo doesn't work that's that kind of amount others think Chelsea just given if they knew they needed their player and they knew they could meet up the action price for Brighton why then they do it previous months ago but hey all said and done Casado to Liverpool might be a down deal right now and hey there's nothing anyone could do Klopp is waiting to speak to Casado one-on-one -on -one before his press conference today. Let's see how it will go. But talking about Klopp, that brings me to his previous interviews, his previous press conferences, talking about how the transfer window is, prices of players are very higher and he is not ready to spend any amount or any big money on players. He wants to um, work on reducing players' prices and right now it looks like Liverpool is turning the other way around. I'm waiting to see what Klopp will be saying. I'm waiting to see what he is really going to speak with Caicedo or his press conference, what he's really going to say about Caicedo because this is a record signing in the Premier League. 110 million pounds has never happened before and has never happened. Enzo was the only player close but with this season transfer window we saw similar of Arsenal and West Ham for decline rise but it was just 105 million pounds. But hey, Casado have beaten the record. But let's wait and see whether Chelsea will overbeat uh, Liverpool or is still going to stay like this. Let me know your opinions, guys. If you just join us and you are new, remember to hit the subscription button, turn on your notification bell, like and share the video, and I'm going to see you in the next video.